people are being brought together by a shared understanding of what's happening to our country. And that shared understanding can be summed up very simply. The government of the United States of America is not working. It is not solving the people's problems. We're facing a slow motion catastrophe that's happening day by day, year by year, and decade by decade, where basically we are losing the ability to govern ourselves. These two great political parties, once broad, once overlapping each other, once working together, have become over the course of decades narrower and narrower, more and more homogenous, smaller and smaller, to the point where no one from the middle would run in one of their primaries because you can't get nominated by parties who have defined themselves so narrowly. I think March 28th, 2012 should go down as a historic day. That was the day that Olympia Snow said, I've had enough. She said the United States Senate has essentially become a parliamentary body. That's not the way our system was designed. A parliamentary body is when you have to vote with the party every time. That's what, how the whole parliamentary system works. Every vote is loyalty. And that's when I said to myself, this isn't the way our system was designed to work. If Olympia, with all of her experience, her seniority, her ability, her integrity, her relationships, couldn't do anything, then to me that tells us that nobody wearing the label can do anything. The only option, therefore, is to try it a different way. Civil discourse doesn't require that we leave our principles at the door. It doesn't. It only requires that we talk with each other in a civil way about our principles and find common ground to solve problems. Our governing institutions are broken. That doesn't mean that the people who inhabit those institutions are broken. Not at all. I can tell you that there are a bunch of good people in your nation's capital trapped in bad institutions. The idea that if we disagree with people politically, they are bad people is just wrong. And that, we got to start with the premise. And, and I loved it when Bill said, we are bad people, we are bad people. So. There are people, as Bill has observed and as Angus has said, there are good people in the Senate who are just waiting for an opportunity to do the right thing. Google U.S. Constitution, read Article 1, which talks about the Congress. You can read it a hundred times until your eyes cross. You will never find the word party. You won't find the word caucus. What you find is a mechanism to solve the nation's problems. The agenda that Nancy and Bill and others have put together is sensible. It's simple. It can work. And all we need is the force of people like all of us to get behind it and we can make it happen. The dogmas of the quiet past are inadequate to the stormy present. The occasion is piled high with difficulty and therefore we must rise with the occasion. As our case is new, so we must think anew and act anew. And here's the key line. We must disenthrall ourselves, and then we shall save our country. Thank you.